Hello there everybody, I am the Request Entry and my battery is on my okay no never mind. Um I'm Request Entry and welcome to this new let's play Kirby's Epic Yarn and Wait this is one play area No I'm gonna just erase it it's a test video I made a few a few days ago. Well, no, yesterday I mean. There we go. All right, no. Cut. Welcome to Dreamland, a kingdom famous for peace and quiet. It's the perfect little land if you like that sort of thing. Lately, there have been rumors of a caped sorcerer going around, turning people into yarn. That's right, yarn. One day, Kirby saw his favorite food, a bright red tomato on top of a bush. I bet it's yummy, but when Kirby tried to eat it, a caped sorcerer appeared. My name is... Hey, what are you doing? Stop that! No! That's my magic metamato! Kirby gulped the metamato right down. Just then, a white sock around the sorcerer's neck began to glow. Then it sucked Kirby up. This grass feels funny, Kirby thought. It feels like trousers. And to Kirby's surprise, he saw that his entire body was made out of yarn. Then he saw a yarn monster chasing a blue yarn boy. Somebody help me! Kirby tried to swallow the monster up. But the air went right through his body. Kirby wondered what he should do. Suddenly, Kirby transformed into a car. He drove away with the boy and left the monster behind to eat his dust. Apparently, that strange metamato gave Kirby the power to seamlessly transform into a car and who knows what else. Right, that was the ending of the cutscene thingy. Um... Well, thanks for saving me. What's that? You're from you're from another world. Well, welcome to Patchlands. You just stick with me, and I'll show you the ropes. Literally. <laughs> Set of me of yarn. Ugh. This is my castle, so feel free to look around here as much as you want. All right, save him. Yeah. Patch Castle. And select one player. Go. Alright, let's go. Jump. And. Yeah. So, ba okay, my neck hurts a bit. So, I'm sorry for that. Basically, what is going. Uh. Uh. What is going on YouTube? I am the Rayquaza Entry, and yeah, welcome to this let's play of Kirby's Epic Yarn, and it's gonna go back and wait until this thing comes again, and yeah, yeah. Alright, I'm here with the let's play of uh, Kirby's Epic Yarn, because it's Epic Yarn, it's my f that's what an, an older friend of mine used to say, it's not friends anymore, okay. Uh, never mind. Um. Um. Now, why did I decide to do this game? Because it's because the game. I like the game. It, it's happy and you know. No, 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 douche like douchebag, but like douche kick, skidoosh, skidoosh. And yeah, then the whole thing explodes. All right, now, um. The reason I decided to do this game is because, um, 
This game is Kirby, and I want to do a Kirby game. I really want to. Now, I tried a few of the older Kirby games, you know, the, 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 the 2D games, and I was like, yeah, you know what? Never mind, I'm gonna do a, a Kirby Wii game, and I decided to do um this game. Because I want to do Return to Dreamland, but... Crap, wow, that, that was just awesome. Alright, now I wanted to do um, Return of the Dreamlands, but and then I was like, never mind, because I tried it and um, the audio was all sync and all. Same with my Crash Bandicoot 2 Let's Play, which I still need to remove, and my Princess Persia Let's Play, I'm gonna remove that too, because um, there's a different game before that, which is called Two Thrones, and I want to do them in order, you know, Princess Persia 1, 2, 3, and yeah, I started with Princess Persia 2, it's stupid for me. I'm going to, I, I think I'm going to do it after, um, I have a better computer, I guess, because, you know, my, my, my computer, come on, my, my computer is not all that great, and, no, it, ca it can't take much, it can't take it even, it can't even take freaking Modern Warfare 1, and that's kind of a shame. I just don't like to have to play, you know, careful all the time, like... Come on, come on, come on... Oh, great. So stupid. I don't- I don't hope you guys hear double audio. I- I don't like it when people hear double audio, it's stupid. Oh. We're done. Cut in again. Thanks for your help, the blue yarn boy said. Not that I needed it. I'm Prince Fluff. Ever since Yin Yarn the Sorcerer ripped Patchland into seven pieces, you just can't go anywhere without running into these horrible... But Fluff was interrupted when they were attacked by a huge three-eyed blob of yarn. Ugh, yuck! Stop it! But before the blob could eat Prince Fluff, Kirby transformed and smashed it to smithereens in a most spectacular fashion. Among the little blob bits, there was a shimmering piece of spiraling yarn. That's it. That's a piece of the magic yarn, Fluff exclaimed. This was what Prince Fluff had been looking for. Yin Yarn had stolen the magic yarn from Patchland. The yarn weaved its way into the fabric of the kingdom and stitched two pieces of patchland together. What about the other pieces? I've got to find the rest of them. Kirby, always happy to help, decided to help his friend recover the missing pieces, and the two began their journey to stitch patchland back together. All right, we're done with this. Now it's saving, and and half of the whole thing was just cutscene, and then that, and then cutscene. And where the hell am I going? Yeah. All right, now see. Alright, same thing. That's boring. But it's okay, I guess. Now, thanks for watching this episode of Kirby's Epic Yarn. And I'll see you people in the next episode. I'm the Requay93. And. Yeah, why the hell did I even say that? Alright, thanks for watching. See you guys in the next episode. Bye bye.